Hey guys, I'm JD Ross, and today I'm going to teach you what to do when you install GTA 5 using Heroic Launcher, but somehow Rockstar Games Launcher is asking you to buy the game again. The first thing that we're going to do is replace the Wine version that you're using. Go to Settings, Advanced, and then check Allow using a Valve button, and then click I understand. And then go to Library, Open GTA 5 Settings, and select Thornton Experimental. Scroll down a bit and click Wine CFG. It might take a few seconds before it appears, so just be patient. Okay, and then select Windows 11, apply, and okay. Press play. It might take a minute and then a terminal box or something that will appear. There we go. And then we're going to set up Rockstar Games Launcher. Just keep pressing continue, accept, continue, continue. There we go. Close. Okay. And then you need to log in your Rockstar Games account. Click Auto Sign In and Sign In. Okay. Now, this is your problem, right? So it's going to show on GTA 5 says buy now. Ignore that. Okay. We're going to close the launcher. And then we're going to press play. Okay, enable the load saves. And there we go. The game launched. Now, you might be wondering, what is the difference between what you did and what I did? And the thing that matters the most in this method is selecting the Proton from Valve. In this case, for GTA 5, don't use the Proton that comes from the wine manager of Heroic. And even if you get past the buy now error, or, well, it's not an error, but you can't play the game, right? Even if you get past that, the game will open and then close. You really have to use the Proton Experimental uh, when launching the game from Heroic. Okay, now we're going to add it to Steam. Click the three dots and then add to Steam. There we go. Now, if you want to make sure if it's actually on Steam, uh, we're going to have to restart it. So, uh, as you see, we have GTA 5 Enhanced, but that's my Steam version not the heroic version or the epic games version we're gonna close steam just so it would refresh the library and then we're gonna uh, run it again so now the gta5 from heroic should now be here there we go now let's go and test the game on gaming mode As you can see at the bottom, the controller is working. Okay, it changed to Xbox controller glyphs. Now don't bother playing online, it's not gonna work. Well, it's it's going to work and then it's it'll stop. It will kick you out. So we're just gonna play the story mode. And there we go. That's how you play the Epic Games version of GTA 5 on the Steam Deck using Heroic Games Launcher. If you like more videos like this, consider subscribing and thank you for watching. Some of the Joseph Rockets,